Well, I think we found the desert. <sighs> Nothing beats the great outdoors. Our next destination will be the town of Albana, which lies in the center of this desert here. But before we go there... We camp, right? Huh? Well, yes. going Cisna Oh Hello Leonard we meet again huh. Hi Oh did I wake you I'm sorry No no it's fine I couldn't sleep anyway. Oh, you came alone. What luck. Or perhaps... Perhaps these birds sensed what I was thinking. How much... I wanted to speak to you again. I... uh... yeah? If it weren't for you... Where would I be? Dead amongst the castle's ashes. I owe you no less than my life. Leonard. It was nothing. Uh, anyway, never mind that. Where are you, Princess? Huh? I'm not certain. All I see is endless desert. The ship has landed here amidst the sand. Wait, I think I see a town through the window. Town? That's got to be Albana. Just sit tight. We're coming. We're going to rescue you. I know you are, Leonard. I believe in you. Princess. Call me Cisna. I wish we could talk some more, but I have to be careful. See you soon, Leonard. Goodbye, Cisna. Indeed. It does seem that way. We cannot allow him to grow any more powerful than he already is. I do have one suggestion, my general. Go on. You see, a pact with a knight is forever. Which leaves us but one way to break it. Isn't it obvious? The pact maker's death. Assassination? Yes, of course. I take it you have a plan. I 
always do, General. Ugh, oh, it's hot. Better get used to it, Yuli. Albana is not as far as you might think. But there are monsters in these sands. We'll have to keep our strength up for the battles ahead. Yeah, we know. Hey! You think I could learn how to dance? <laughs> no. No, I don't. I never featured you a man of culture. What's with this heat? As long as we keep our bearings, we'll be fine. I've had enough of you! How feeble! Let's not do that again. White warrior, wielder of the ancient sword, grant me your power. Vertum! I will grant no water. Let's finish this!
The winds are against us. Come on, at least try! Stay on them! What? That's it? Putting an end to this. Today's a scorcher. Was that meant to be a fight? Cisna, 
Leonard, keep muttering like that and you'll trip. Get your head out of the clouds, lad. Let's make this quick. Wise, white warrior, wielder of the ancient sword, grant me your power. There to You think I could learn how to dance? <laughs> no. No, I don't. I never featured you a man of culture. are as hostile as the desert. If I fall over, one of you pick me up, okay? So, what now? First, we need to find out if anyone's seen any black mono ships. Right. If a Magi were here, someone would have spotted that ship of theirs. How could they miss it? It's far too big to hide, that's for sure.
Hey, mind if we rest? Should I ask her if she's single? Oh, no. It's not that. It's just she's so flexible. We'll attract too much attention if we move in a group. All right? Got it. It's no good. No one's talking. Wait. Notice anything else unusual? Well, actually, it does kind of feel like we're being watched. Maybe it's just because we're strangers here.
Surrounded. What did I do? You step outside. We didn't do anything to you or your friends. What do you want with us? Hmm. Need I spell it out? Here are looks and no smarts, pretty boy. Simple. We want you dead. <sighs> Leonard, careful. She's got an ace up her sleeve. Take them out. I've beat up monsters a lot prettier than you. Hey, just listen for a sec. <laughs> Eldor. You sense it too. There's something very different about that woman. I see you know how to fight. Bravo. But we're not through yet. Advain. Is that... another knight? No. That is a Yegus. A Yegus? A beast summoned from the magic plane. The packmaker surrenders her body and the beast's power enters her flesh. Beast and human then fuse into one. I'm still confused by all this knight stuff. Don't make it worse. Figure it out later, Leonard. Right now, we need your knight. Let's finish this! I can't take her on like this. Thank <laughs> you. 
Only the knight can stop her. White warrior, wielder of the ancient sword, grant me your power. Vertum! We'll see who laughs last. Hey there. Uh, you people! Tell me, what happened? The Yigas had almost completely taken over. Yigas? You made a pact with the Yigas. It was eating into your soul bit by bit. Eventually it would have consumed you completely. Yes. I remember feeling trapped. You're safe now. As for the beast you made a pact with, we dispatched it. I promise you, it'll trouble you no more. Thank you. I wish you would just explain. Why do all this? Our town, Albana. It was invaded. By a vile group all clad in black armor. Don Fibonacci normally protects the peace here. But they paid him off and did what they wanted. Did these people in the black armor tell you to kill me? Yes. And you said, yeah, sure, just like that. No, of course not. The soldiers took my sister Lena hostage. They threatened to kill her if I didn't do what they said. And how is it you came by, Aegis? They forced me to take it. They said I must use it when I fought you. That's terrible. Hey, listen. Do you know where their monoship was headed? It was black. Anything you can tell us will help. I saw it. Oh. Really? You're sure? Of course. What do you take me for, you impudent pup? All right. Sorry. Can you tell us when this was? Just yesterday. It was this huge black ship descending toward the ruins in the south. Though I can't imagine why. Then my suspicions were right. The Magi want something at those ruins. We have to go after them. Please, take me with you. Huh? My name is Kara. I didn't do what they told me to do. My sister. They would kill her. If you are going to confront these Magi, it may be my only chance to save her. Or a second chance to try and kill us. Eldor! No, I swear I won't. Please, believe me. Mm. She'll die. You must take me with you. I beg you. Yes. I believe you. 
As you wish. So, no one else saw the ship?